Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, for those of you who don't know. And for today's video, we're going to do a Gerard Cosmetics unboxing. If you guys do not know, I am a Gerard Cosmetics affiliate. So if you guys do like any of these products, or if you guys want to purchase anything off of Gerard Cosmetics, I would kindly appreciate it if you guys did use my discount code. I'm going to leave it on the screen for you guys. If you guys do use it, I do get a small commission for it. So without further ado, let's get to opening up this PR box. Handy, handy scissors. Ooh, all right, let's pause for a thumbnail. All right, guys, so first thing I gotta do is open this up because I forgot I got a sweatshirt, and this makes me so happy. But I got a sweatshirt. Ah, I'm so excited. I love sweatshirts, I love wearing sweatshirts in the winter time. This is like my go to sweatshirt and leggings, especially now because I'm remote. This is what I'm going to be wearing often, so I'm so, so excited. Thank you so much, Jen. I am very happy I have a sweatshirt. This is my size medium. Uh, I feel like it's going to fit pretty well, and I can't wait. And first thing we're going to open up is the Gerard Cosmetics, obviously, because this is a Gerard Cosmetics haul. Baby Plus Illuminating Facial Cream. This is in Sophia, so maybe I have this in Grace. Can you hear that? It's like an ASMR video. Oh no. I don't remember this being like runny like water. Maybe because it's too hot? That shouldn't really affect it, right? No, it's like all liquidy. I don't remember it looking like this. My previous one was more like kind of creamy. Yeah, that's what like my previous one looked like. Like kind of creamy-ish like that. Let's just put some on the back of my hand. That was too much, Melissa. Too much. You can mix this underneath the foundation to get a nice illuminating look. You can use this on its own to just illuminate your face. I'm a little oily, so I will probably I would probably mix this with a foundation. But look at how beautiful that is. This is what I remember. I could just like even wear this on like my décolleté for like a nice highlight. I feel like that is stunning. Again, this is the shade Sophia. A little bit dark for like my hand, but for like my neck, it'll probably work out really, really nice. It's, that's actually a beautiful, beautiful shade. Now we have the Clean Canvas Eye Concealer and Base. This one is in the shade White. I have one in like the nude shade, so it'll match my like complexion. I loved this, and I wanted to get the white we do get PR credit, so when I say I wanted to get, it is because it is a credit and I am able to pick out what I want, which I appreciate. So this I was really excited for because look at that. That is so freaking white, and I feel like if I put a eyeshadow on top of this, and a little bit goes a long way. Like guys, I put too much on, and I still have a ton left, so you do not need that much. But imagine just a pretty, like, vibrant color. The white is going to make it so much more intense that I am very excited to test this out on my eyeballs because that was very vibrant. And I feel like it's going to make any eyeshadow look stunning. We have a Slay All Day Setting Spray. This is in the shade shade the scent peach i'm telling you i i don't film for like two months and i forget makeup in general i gotta spray it oh i love i feel like the pe the scent of peach or like the taste of peach is like my favorite anything peach scented or flavored or whatever i love so i am excited that i got that next thing we have is a color your smile lip gloss this is in the shade pink frosting Ooh, this is a vibrant pink one thing that i love about their glosses is that they do have the little light i find that super handy because they even have a mirror back here so when you're like on the go running around and everything you have a little light you can go ahead and line your lips fill them in you know get a perfect application. Ooh, that's actually really pretty. I thought it was going to be more pigmented, but it's not. Can you guys see that? It's not as pigmented as I thought it would be. And I'm here for it. There's a little bit of like shimmer in there, but nothing crazy. I actually really, really like this. Next 
one we have is a Lyrica Anderson at Time Straw Cosmetics Light em Up Lip Gloss. This one is in the shade Pretty Woman. Oh my god, this red. And we have the same exact thing, a little light. Oh my god, that is stunning. It's beautiful. I love a nice red lip, especially a gloss. Look at how stunning. That is super pigmented. And I feel like a little wing, this is like the perfect look perfect look especially for fall it is really pretty and then the last thing we have is a lipstick this one is in the shade mystic moon and this is the color let's go ahead and swatch oh that's pretty that's a really pretty nude honestly it is a little bit more of like a cool gray undertone but i don't mind i feel like that looks really really nice pair that with like a cool lip liner a london i believe by nyx is like a cool lip liner that'll look really pretty so i love my cool moments i mean you typically i go for my pinky nudes or my peachy nudes but sometimes you need a good cool mood and i feel like this is it this looks really really nice so i'm excited excited to test that out and that is everything that i got in my pr box so i just want to thank gerard cosmetics and jen for gifting me these items i'm so excited i'm very excited to use everything and if you guys did enjoy this video please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you go if you do like what you see so i hope that you guys are doing well and that you guys are safe and i will see you guys in a few days in my next video bye